all right guys so welcome to this video in this video we'll learn something about video marketing and we'll first understand what is actually a video campaign so right now I'm inside my Google AdWords platform and I will just click on this campaign and I'll select this video format which is video ads on YouTube and across the web so I'll click on this video and it will give me an option to create a campaign that would be video campaign so we'll understand what basically the difference is between a video campaign and the normal search network campaigns so for this video campaign let's say I type in a campaign name so I would say first video campaign right my type would be obviously video I'll select standard because I want to have ads driving views awareness and conversions so I'll go with standard now I'll let's suppose I want to have my budget as 500 rupees per day and over here you'll have delivery method which would be standard or accelerated so always have standard why because you want to evenly distribute your advertisement or your video ads for the entire day you don't want to accelerate because if you accelerate chances are there that Google will display your YouTube video constantly I mean very fast so your ads would be as quickly as possible and your budget would, uh, might get exhausted before 24 hours so always go for standard then you have networks always have all these three checked in because you want to display your video ad on YouTube search YouTube videos and including video partners as well all right then we have location which is pretty basic if I want to select India all countries or let me choose or advanced search radius targeting whatever you want you can do over here then you have languages then you have devices so this is pretty basic so the only difference here on this campaign level was this video for this video we have this standard format so we'll select this video over here instead of search network which we used to do previously so then we'll go ahead and we'll click on save and continue obviously if you want to change any frequency or capping or anything which you want or delivery method or schedule time if you want to schedule your uh, advertisement according to particular uh, period of time then yes you can definitely do it on campaign level setting all right so now once we are done with campaign level settings we have this create ad group and add so now guys in this video campaign you don't have three tabs or four tabs on the top what I have is create campaign and create an ad group and add so ad group and ad level are both on the same page so I just select this ad group as and I'll copy the URL of one of my videos and my video would be on so I'll get a preview over here so now we'll have some video ad formats alright so you will only get two options over here but let me just brief you about what uh, other formats were available on YouTube for video so we had something called as true view so true view is a YouTube video ad format that gives the viewer options the most common of which is the ability to skip the advertisement after five seconds so there are four types of true view ads the first is in stream advertisement so in stream ads allow viewers to skip the pre roll ads after five seconds sponsors pay only for ads that are viewed in their entirety or until 30 seconds have elapsed in stream ads are suitable for short or long video content so if my advertisement has not been played or maybe if it is played and if it was for less than or equal to 30 seconds then I won't be charged but if it is more than 30 seconds then I would be paying to Google for displaying my video so even if it is for 31 seconds people have watched my particular ad that I would be paying certain amount then we have in slate advertisements 
What is insulate advertisements? They allow viewers to, among several sponsored ads, or opt for commercial breaks interspaced through the video content. So sponsors pay for ads that are selected by the viewer, and insulate ads are suitable for videos that are at least 10 minutes long. So what this means is. Let's suppose you might have a very long video like uh, let's search for one of the videos like comedy nights with couple and let's search him on YouTube. I just misspelled that but I guess it would give me the correct option. So let's suppose this is a pretty uh, big format right now over here. So let's just click and see if there are guys right now i am not able to see over here any gaps but what you can see is at times on particular stages you might have some bars over here so you will have division so once you are reaching this four minute and ten seconds you will have an advertisement then and then after that advertisement completes this segment would start once again and it might go up to a few more minutes and then once again there would be an advertisement so within this entire 49 minutes, 49 minutes and 49 second video, you will have various segments within which there would be advertisements. So those are known as in-slate advertisements. Alright. Then we have in-search ads. In-search ads. Now in-search ads appear in YouTube search results when the viewer's search is related to the ads keyword. Or sponsors pay for ads that a viewer that the viewer begins to watch. So what this advertisement means is, if I am on YouTube and if I type something like digital marketing and I hit enter, then right now there is no advertisement over here. So let's type in very something very general, uh, like uh, top ten old Hindi Bollywood or Hindi songs of all time so still I'm not getting any results let's search for top 10 actors of Bollywood all right still not getting any what would be the general topic try this so still I'm not able but guys what I'm trying to say is if for particular result if I'm able to see any advertisement on the top over here before the organic searches starts then those type of advertisement which you are able to see on the top over here where it could be saying advertisement which is like A and D just add just as we have on Google so if we type digital marketing on Google then we would be having some advertisements like this ad so similarly on YouTube as well at times you get advertisement wherein you will have this ad written in yellow color so all those advertisements are known as in search advertisement all right then we have last which is in display ads in display ads are legal free formats that appear in YouTube promoted videos overlay, in video suggestions and related videos, and in Google's click to play format as well. Sponsors are charged when viewers opt to watch an ad. Alright, so this is pretty basic, simple. So now once again let's move on to our campaign. So I will show you. Now there are only two options right now over here available on Google AdWords. One is in stream. In stream is something wherein somebody would have their video, and on that video, your advertisement might be displayed. Your video ad would be displayed. So, after five seconds, there would be an option to skip your ad. So, that would be your in stream ad. Second is you have in display ad. Alright, in display ad. So in display ad has this kind of formats. On YouTube search results, you will have something like this, the dark portion. Then on YouTube related search, 
or YouTube related videos you will have the related video over here if you are able to see anything over here that is in display so this is on YouTube related videos then we have as a YouTube overlay as a YouTube overlay something wherein our video would be over here by default on somebody else's video and on partner websites so this would be something which would be treated as something similar to display networks so whatever your YouTube partners are YouTube search partner on those websites your video would be displayed at times all right then you can also choose the uh, thumbnail if you want this one this one or this one whatever all right so that is in display so now let's go with in stream first so what will happen is we can have this display URL over here so let's suppose if I type pratikshichudasma.com so see on this particular advertisement people would be able to see my link just like this visit pratikshichudasma.com and then I will have my actual URL which is http colon slash slash www.pratikshichudasma.com Alright, so this is how you can insert a link inside your advertisement. Then you can have a companion banner which is use auto generated image from videos in your channel. So this, this, this image which you have, you can upload your own image as well over here, which would be companion banner over here. Alright, which has the dimension of 300 by 60 pixels and maximum up to 150 kb. So once you are done, you will have a video ad name so let's say I would say video ad number one all right and then I will have my maximum cost per view that is TPV so I would have a typical range over here suggested by AdWords which is 2.67 up to 12.01 so maximum CPV is the highest price you are willing to bid for someone to view your video when it is run as an ad. So let's suppose I say 5.06 something like that. Alright so once I click on that I will have this estimated views or estimated target over here. Alright and then we go down and we have targeting over here when we can have some demographics targeted gender age parental status and some interest and according to that our potential reach over here would change and then once you click on save ad group that's it it would ask me for linking my adwords account that's it that's the last step so you will have to link your adwords to this particular channel which is YouTube channel so once I click on YouTube channel or link channel so this is the option once you click on that it would be redirected your uh, your page would be redirected over here so just because I just uh, moved away from that page now I would be able to get that option but it would be something like you have requested to link channel Pratiksi Chudasma alright and once you link it it would be giving you verification message so I'll click on finish as of now and it would have your campaign live right now so as you can see it is enabled type is in screen add group bids maximum CPV is 5 Ps and 6 PASA so if you want edit you can just click on edit over here all right so once it uh, gets it start getting views it will start getting views you will have all the analysis over here then you can go down and you can see all this age and gender as well and you can see from where you are actually getting the traffic all right you can add the traffic So this is how you do these advertisements. All right, this is how you do advertisements.
then for this keywords part you can include this exclusion so what is this this is negative keyword negative keyword if i say exclusion i can say up to two levels campaign exclusion or ad group exclusion all right and then it will be done the negative keyword would be added to your campaign or ad group and over here you can just is exclude a particular thing which you don't want to display all right so this was all about your understanding of video campaign creating your first video campaign importance of video marketing so basically why videos are important now because it is the easiest form of conveying message right now all right it is the easiest form of message because if you write some 1000 words article then if you have an infographic and then if you have a video then most of the people would be getting on to videos so you get better results when you have videos for your uh, value or for sharing information of your business then we have something known as uploading your videos on video marketing websites now what are these video marketing websites video marketing websites uh, let me just give you a couple of names they are youtube then we have something called as vimeo we have Vistia, we have something called as one we have periscope we have meerkat and lot many other platforms wherein we can upload our videos all right wherein we can upload our videos but the most common which is used is youtube then vimeo and vistia are also being used a lot of things a lo lot of times and then we have periscope now periscope is a recent thing which has been trending a lot and which is going viral it is a live broadcasting stream app all right it's a mobile app you can't use it on desktop it's a mobile app all right so now things are changing people are getting on mobile then we have wine wine is something like wherein you can upload a six second video only only a six second video so it can demonstrate something for your article in brief within those six seconds all right so that is wine and meerkat is something similar to periscope Initially, Meerkat came in and then Periscope jumped in, but Periscope had very advanced platform and easy to use. So now Meerkat is like Orkut and Periscope is like Facebook. <laughs> Alright, so these are a couple of uh, video marketing websites. So basically not video marketing websites. These are video submission directories you can see, where you upload your videos and promote your uh, business through videos all right out of which we will be seeing youtube as a work business how to treat everything on youtube all right so that was it guys uh, that was all about this particular video we will be looking into youtube in detail in another video so till then guys thank you so much for joining this uh, particular video hope you had some insights on video campaign and creating your campaign inside adwords so thank you so much guys, stay awesome, cheers, bye bye.